Walders and Wallace, the first two have to carry it down the 50 meter course and then replace it with the sack double the weight of the other end. It certainly isn't recommended treatment for slipped discs. And Walders, who himself has come back to these events after that injury, shows that his spirit is willing and saw his legs. Now a slick changeover can save a second or two. And those proficient at putting their trousers and braces on in the dark are at a distinct advantage. Now with the harness provided, the temptation is to lean back and use the thighs as a principal force. Remember, there seems enough sand in there to fill the road hole bunker at St. Andrews. It is a torturous 50 meters. The Austrian Wallace hasn't really come to terms with the technique. Anyway, by the look of it, he takes a size smaller than a harness. The whole sack, of course, is to cross the line. And he's done it in two minutes, 43.2, but at what great cost. Grizzly has the weight all right, but in this event, he is no Carl Lewis. Namisto is the oldest man in the tournament, and unlike Samson, he kept his strength when he lost his hair. And with his kind of pace, he must be making disturbing viewing for Capes and Sigmason. Now, this is the bit of the turn Grizzly will really like, reminding him of what he does in the wrestling ring. The Finn is electing for the long rope, so it doesn't look as if he's suffered so far. Namisto didn't even have time to say cheerio and passing Grizzly the other way. And the affable American is toiling. Namisto's coach senses a very good time as he belts it out and finish. And with the crowd sharing the support for him, if he can drag himself in quickly, he'll end up with a splendid time. Practiced hard at this event, and it looks as if it's paying off for him now. He's also smooth. Oh, he didn't want that part touching the ground. And Mark Higgins, his coach, knows just how much to scream at him. Well, that fall has broken the momentum of the pool, apart from losing him seconds. Well, that unfortunately stems from even Capes getting tired. But he's done it in a very impressive one minute, 15.8. He also has some sack to pull. Signs of a tired man there. It's very quick, even though there are more than traces of a struggle now in Sigmundson. But he's over in an astonishing one minute, 6.4.